Welcome, my, my name is Chelsea Terry. I'm the communications coordinator at Penticton Art Gallery as well as Ignite the Arts Festival. We like to describe Ignite the Arts Festival as spring break camp for artists and attendees. It's a place and gathering for many different creatives, mostly our local community coming together with acts that we've brought in as far as Vancouver Island, Alberta, down in the States as well. We start strong with a mini mural unveiling at the Cannery Brewing. We work throughout the week on different workshops. We've got things for kids, such as songwriting camps. We've got things for adults as well, uh, including sound and tech workshops for musicians. We have our Community Art Walk, which is a partnership with the Penticton and District Community Arts Council. That all rolls into our festival weekend, which is where we focus mainly on music. And that's when we have 45 minute sets, um, revolving stages of downtown. That includes Cannery Brewing, Legacy Den, Highway 97, two different stages at Elks Hall. We have the Dream Cafe running a stage as well. And then we have theater performances all running in Tempest. We also have specific stage themes. For instance, at Legacy Den, we have more of an ambient vibe. Then uh, at Brit Bar, it's our latest stage. So we'll have the more electronic sets, the more dancey sets, you know, lots of laser lights and things like that. So I'm so excited. If you want to find out more about Community Week events or the festival weekend, get your pass, get your wristband, get that all sorted, please head over to ignitethearts.ca. We've got all of the schedules up ready for you to view. All the registration links and everything that you possibly need is right there for you. So please enjoy and come on down to Penticton and enjoy Ignite the Arts with us.